Hello YouTube friends and welcome to my channel. In this video I would like to share with you another beautiful Tusa knife that I got just recently and this is the TS-116. Uh, uh, yeah, uh, these knives are getting quite large so Tusa will probably have to redesign uh, their box. Uh, this is a wonderful box and they have used it for quite a few years. But now uh, some of the designs are getting uh, larger or wider so yeah okay so this is how the knife comes uh, it was original originally packaged in two so baggies this one is still uh, a little bit uh, filled with oil tucson will nicely protect your knife in transit and also storage so you don't have to be worried about that you will have any kind of rust spots and they also gave me two bags in this one so i have did clean the knife up and put it in the next one so you, you don't see any kind of residue from oil okay so firstly uh, let me show this new or should i say uh, they have been using it for a while but this is the new deep carry pocket clip excellent design we are getting quite quite uh, far away from uh, from the old yeah, bend over titanium clip they are used on all designs this this one is the uh, 47 so TS47 in G10 but yeah this is uh, this is unusable this is really bad so really stiff and yeah. so thumbs up uh, to Sun for uh, hearing out on the community and upgrading the pocket clip okay so the ts116 which is this one once again is a beautiful collaboration with max uh tikachuk i hope i pronounced his name uh some way uh how he pronounces it sorry if i butchered it but uh like you probably know if you've seen some of my videos, uh, Tucson is a Chinese company, a value-oriented company, which will give you good materials, in some, uh, in some version, great materials, even greater materials, and also a really good fit and finish, so excellent quality uh, control. I must give them big thumbs up for that at a, um, should I say, value-oriented price point. Uh, but we will talk about pricing later. So the TS116 is a really uh, nice and big folder. So we have overall length of uh, 22.6 centimeters or 8.9 inches, almost 9 inches, so almost as a, uh, a SMF, a Strider SMF. If you know, uh, I really like a, a Strider knife, so this is one of the largest production they have in uh, offering. But uh, let's continue with the, with the specifications. So the blade length is 8.8 .8 centimeters or 3.46 uh, inches. The handle length is 12.5 centimeters or 4.9 inches. The blade thickness is 3.8 millimeters or 0 0.15 inch. So here on the spine. Uh, the blade on this one is 40C28N, which is a really nice uh, stainless steel and we have a blade grinded set and finish. The handle materials are made of G10. We also really nice, so a pivot, pivot color with a more blue. So this is a gray and blue. Uh, this is more, more bright, more navy blue. So yes. And we have also a nice um, blue backspacer. We have milled out pockets inside. The log engagement is nice and early. We have a KVT ball bearing uh, system in the pivot of course and perfect centering once again a really nice 
fold over stainless steel pocket clip and I wish they were used flush screws but uh, let me show you the pocket profile so that you see how this one rides in your pocket so this is excellent nice and smooth so it will not shred your pockets this is how much it will stick out so just a little bit if you carry a jeans then it will be completely hidden because it uh, matches almost uh, the colors of the jeans yeah um, so the weight the weight of the knife is 116 grams or 4.09 ounces which is really nice and compact size if we can say compact size but yeah not that heavy okay uh, regarding the price so like I mentioned Tucson will give you a really excellent uh, uh, value for your money uh, money is always a question always uh, always if you are in this hobby if you're collecting knives then you have to to spend it wisely and why to pay more if you can uh, pay less so the the price they are asking for is 44.99 usually they uh, will have uh, this knife also on offer also on, on, on discount um, you can save a little bit also if you are uh, trying uh, to go on ebay uh, tucson has uh, so as far as I know, that is in 2020, uh, they have two outlets. So one is one is eBay, and one is AliExpress. Uh, on AliExpress, uh, they have uh, lots of model available available right to purchase. So you will just go there, and if you like something, you just buy whatever quantity they have available. And if you want to save money, then you can um, go on eBay and try to bid on on some of the models they have on eBay usually they uh, you will save more money on eBay of course um, but that it depends how many people at that moment want to to buy that knife okay so if if they are on sale uh, they will give you somewhere from uh, from 9 to to 10 something more percent off so just uh, just wait and check out the, the options if you don't uh, want the knife right uh, now then uh, it is always too good to uh, to check out the pricings and and wait some time so here is the maker's mark the logo of the designer a nice skull and bones and the blade designation okay now let me show you a few size comparisons so like I always do here is the 111 from Tucson knives one of my most favorite uh, frame lock designs they have produced then here is the Spyderco Delica here is the Benchmade small grip Tillian this is the spider coin dura which is smaller uh, a large reptilian is here uh, this is the benchmade vintage pro skyline from kershaw Shuffle 2 from Kershaw K-Bar Dozier and let me bring out also ASMF So he's a production Strider SMF it's Almost the same size Okay, so this was the Tucson TS116 uh, if you have any questions, please leave comments down below. I'm more than happy to reply as soon as I can. Uh, if you are a subscriber, thank you very much. If you are not, then please consider subscribing. 
I try to release at least three videos per week, mostly knife oriented, uh, but also some gear, watches, uh, hobby stuff, like unboxings of books and uh, miniature paintings and so on. So I hope you have a wonderful day and see you soon. Bye.